We just returned from a three-night stay at the Bahia Principe Luxury Ambar in Punta Cana. This is a full video tour of this all-inclusive resort so you know exactly what to expect. Hello Travel Box! The Bahia Principe Luxury Ambar is located on Arena Gorda Beach, one of the best beaches in Punta Cana. However, the beach area of this hotel was not our favorite. It is divided into three sections, one for guests staying at all other resorts in the Bahia Principe complex, which was messy and felt cramped. Another exclusive for guests staying at the Luxury Ambar, which was more organized, had more palapas and huts, and more space between lounge chairs, and another section for privileged club members. The beach was pretty, with the characteristic two-tone and calm water, although it was a bit rocky. The luxury ambar has only one pool. The pool is big and is located near the beach. It has a big bar with dry and wet sides. Our favorite features of this pool were the water faucets which gave great massages. Another nice feature was the sections with bubbling water and water jets, which were very relaxing. The pool area had many lounge chairs with umbrellas, but since this was the only pool of the resort and was always busy, it took a lot of work to find available seats. As a luxury amber guest, you can also use the pools at other Bahia Principe hotels in the complex. The Grand Turquesa has a medium-sized pool and two jacuzzis. The Grand Aquamarine has a larger and prettier pool than the Grand Turquesa and an area with four jacuzzis. The Grand Bavaro has a large pool, and right next door, the Grand Punta Cana has the same pool but mirrored. The Esmeralda Hotel, also part of this complex, was being remodeled during our visit, along with another big pool which you would usually have access to. Bahia Principe Luxury Ambar has two buffet restaurants, a small one by the beach called Las Brisas and a big one called Palmira in the lobby building. Palmira is open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. In addition to Palmira and Las Brisas, eight specialty restaurants complete the culinary offer. The Greek offers Greek food. Tali is the Indian restaurant. Limbo is international cuisine and easily the best restaurant we try. Portofino is the Italian restaurant. Tequila, the Mexican restaurant. The fish market serves seafood. Meat is the steakhouse and the Brazilian rodizio. The specialty restaurants are open for dinner and require a reservation. You also have access to the restaurants in the other resorts, but it's harder to get a reservation since they prioritize guests staying there. If you're hungry between meals, you can grab a snack in several places. The grill by the beach serves grilled meats, vegetables, and paella. Las Brisas Beach Restaurant has a small but varied buffet. Las Olas Beach House is similar to Las Brisas but open to all guests of the Bahia Principe complex. And the coffee shop, our favorite spot in the resort. Here you'll find sweet and savory snacks, coffee, hot tea, iced tea, and the best cookies we've had in a long time. Did you know you can help us grow our channel and it doesn't cost you anything? Simply click on the book now link in the description of any of our videos when you're ready to book your Punta Cana resort. We earn a small commission if you book within 7 days of clicking the link. It helps us grow our channel and doesn't cost you extra. There are few bars in the luxury ambar, but just enough for the resort's size. Besides the pool bar, you can find a bar in the lobby building with plenty of seating and at the Las Olas Beach House. You may also consume at every bar of the complex when out and about. The resort itself is light on amenities due to its small size. There is a reasonable, well-equipped gym if, like us, you like to work out during your vacation. There is also an on-site spa which you have to pay to use. However, the complex has a few amenities you can enjoy. 
There are air hockey and pool tables that are paid to play. There is a basketball court, two hard surface tennis courts, and an improvised court for kids. There are cement ping pong tables, a mini golf course, a foosball table, a beach volleyball court in the Grand Turquesa, a small water park for kids, and speaking of kids, there is also a kids club. You can also borrow equipment for water activities like kayaking. The soccer field was closed during our stay. It was in bad shape, so we assumed they were doing some work to it. There is an area of the Bahia Principe complex called El Pueblito, or the little town, where the casino and disco are located. They do some shows and activities here at night, like the Dominican market, which you must pay extra for. Finally, there's the sports bar, where people hang out at night. Here, you'll also find some pay-to-play games like pool and air hockey. We booked a sweet junior deluxe room and paid $128 per person per night. The room was ample and very comfortable. You'll find the bathroom area to your left as you walk through the door. A single vanity has plenty of counter space and an oversized lighted wall mirror. You'll find plenty of towels and a hair dryer under the sink. To the left, a big shower with a half glass panel and a rain shower head. The toiletries are attached to the wall. On the opposite side, the toilet is separated from the rest of the bathroom by a frosted glass door for privacy. On the wall opposite the sink, you'll find the closet. The space is adequate for two people, and inside there is a pair of bathrobes, an iron with an ironing board, a blanket, and a safe. Before the bedroom area, there's a well-stocked coffee station with a coffee maker. Below the coffee station is the minibar, with two cans of Presidente beer, mini alcohol bottles, three bottles of soda, four bottles of water, and sparkling water. The bedroom had a king-sized bed, two night tables, plenty of outlets and USB charging ports by the bed. Right in front of the bed, there's a big dresser with a wall-mounted TV. Next to it is a bench for your luggage and shoes. A sleek working station and seating area complete the room's look. The room is well illuminated with natural light coming from the balcony. The balcony was small, with basic outdoor furniture. This was the view from our room on the second floor of Building 66. The Bahia Principe complex is beautiful. The vegetation is lush, abundant, tropical, and well-groomed. The luxury ambar is a gorgeous hotel, greenery and infrastructure-wise. It is a small hotel and very easy to walk around. However, if you plan on moving around the complex, you'll have to take the trains that drive between the resorts. Bahia Principe has a busy entertainment schedule. During the day, we participated in a mini golf tournament and a crazy phone party in the pool. The entertainment staff was super active and friendly. We saw karaoke, live singers, live bands, and a fire show at night. The luxury ambar has an active nightlife. Now click on this video to see our honest review of the Bahia Principe Luxury Ambar so you can decide if this is the right resort for your Punta Cana vacation.